Hello everybody, welcome back to Bloodborne. This is part 5, I believe. Uh, we have 9 insight now, we're almost at 10, which means we can get uh, co-op with a friend. Uh, but we won't be seeing that, not for a little while, not until we can find more madmen's knowledge. But uh, in the last episode we bet Father Gascione, and in the episode before that we bet the Cleric Beast. Now the next boss, I believe, thanks to one of my mates on Twitter... Uh, has pointed out that we will be needing some antidote because they're fairly bad with poison. So I'll take like six and I'm going to buy one or two more. Uh, will I buy any more Molotovs? I think I have enough. Oh, I didn't actually buy any Molotovs. Okay, yeah, let's, let's buy some um, before we go anywhere else. Uh, just because they're quite handy to have in the world of Yarnum. Now, uh, I did have enough, almost enough, to get... Ooh, I don't know where to go with it. Maybe the Great Bridge. I haven't really explored there too much after I bit the Cleric Beast. But yeah, um, I am saving up for at least 3,000 uh, Blood Echoes in order to buy myself a, uh, it's like a massive hammer that you can, you know, like, transform. It looks really, really sick. And it does a lot more damage than my current axe, about 15 plus damage. So I can't wait to see what that's like. Alrighty, we're back at the Temple of Odeon. This is where we finished off Father Gascione. I think that's that's not him there, is it? No. I don't think so. He transformed into a massive beast. I got told that I could have used the, uh, the little box. The music box? Yeah, that's the thing right there. A small music box re received from a young Yarnum girl. That was the daughter of Father. Uh, Gascione. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing his name right. Uh, I haven't really explored this area, I haven't gone any further, and that's exactly what we're going to do, because we went right back to the Hunter's Dream as soon as we finished him off. So, we don't have many blood echoes, I'm not really afraid of dying. Still am though, at the same time. Oh yes! That's because we, we finished off that last boss. Nice job, we've opened up the next area. I did think I seen something over here, maybe I didn't. You're better off... Ah! Exploring anyway. A red jeweled brooch. Don't know what the hell that is. Where is it? Oh, okay. Used to gain droplet blood jam. Weird. been loving this game I can't stay away from it for much longer than a couple hours it's just so fantastic no wonder they're giving it huge scores but 93 on Metacritic that's just absolutely insane I'm afraid we're gonna find out what these coffins do very soon oh, nothing there I actually thought there was gonna be a jump scare or something wait that's not open over there, is it? No. I guess we're going to the upper levels of Yarnum. This place looks fucking crazy. What the hell? We're on like a really posh side. The buyer Jen Wirth spider hides all manner of rituals and keeps our lost master from us. A terrible shame. It makes my head shudder uncontrollably. Huh. Oh fuck, I thought it was the spider there. I thought that was going to be a trap chest. Blood gem workshop tool. Weird. Oh, this better not be another boss already. <laughs> One after another, man. No, I guess not. Is anyone else like freaked out right now? Who the hell is that bitch right there? Who the fuck is that? <laughs> oh man. I'd be afraid, very afraid right now. Hmm? 
Oh, you must be a hunter. Very sorry. The insect. Good. Good. I've been waiting for one of your ilk. These hunts have everyone all locked up inside, waiting for it to end. It always does. Always has, you know. Since forever. But it won't end nicely. Not this time. Even some folks hiding inside are going bad. The screams of women folk. The stench of blood. The snarls of beasts. None of them's too uncommon now. Yarnum's done for, I tell ya. But if you spot anyone with their wits about them, tell them about this here Erden Chapel. They'll be safe here. The incense wards off the beasts. Spread the word. Tell them to come on over. If you wouldn't mind. <laughs> right, well, there is uh, one or two people that I know in the world that could actually use this safe haven. I don't actually know if she is telling the truth or not. Um, she might be telling a lot of porky pies. But I don't know. I, I think I might do like off camera just because I, I have to find exactly where they are. Closed, okay. Not too mysterious. I don't know if I should be heading out this door or the one to my left there. Oh. What the f- Do you see that really tall creepy guy? He's one of the creepiest looking guys I've seen in this game. And he's more human than most. Oh. Thought I heard a werewolf there for a second. What? Okay, these bitches are getting fucking tougher. I don't know if it's because I have more insight or what the crack is. Whoa. It's not good for me, though. What do you got, sir? Madman's knowledge? Yes, baby, yes. Oh, there's another little feathery friend over here. Okay, that's you done for. Hmm, I'm trying to think, should I go up this way or should I go down to the left? Because you can kind of make your own paths and there's a load of optional bosses and stuff, so... It's quite hard to decide which way is the, the right way. Oh, he's got a soul, or a soul lantern or a blood lantern or something? There's two of those guys. Okay, you're done. Good, good. I've been very unlucky with finding blood vials of late. Oh, nice! Hunter Garb! The fuck is that? The fuck was that? Some fucking big ass blue orb. Everyone else seen that, right? <laughs> I don't know what the hell that was. Okay, right, what I'm gonna do is equip some of the armor there. While I'm inside this temple. <laughs> A top hat. I don't think the defense would be very good. It's got better blunt defense, that's about it. Foreign garb, hunter garb. Hmm. I don't think I'll bother with that. Okay, let's just go. I want to go this way. I want to find out what the hell the blue orb thing was. The fuck is that?
You don't take much damage. Okay. Hello? Wow. Shit. Why am I using an antidote? He takes so much health. Or, like, damage. Oh my god. This is bad news. This is so fucking bad. Look at the size of this man. Come on, attack me. Attack me! Holy shit. Okay, please don't attack me. Took him down. <laughs> Fucking sick of you, man. You're done for. Okay, we just got really lucky there. I, th I think we did. Maybe I'm getting better at it. Might not be though. Don't know what this device does. Ah. It closes that off. I don't know if that really should be closed or not. Okay, maybe if I open that one. Okay, alright, let me try this out for a second. I'm gonna try open this this one here. Maybe I should explore down here a little bit first. The fuck is that thing? Oh, it's one of those guys. I thought he, he was like a werewolf. Hey, better, better, hey, better, better. You done, son? <laughs> Shining coins, more of them, brilliant. Oh, fuck. Stupid little birds. They, they don't know when to quit, man. Okay, right. This is probably one of those times I should be doing this off-camera, kind of exploring, but I thought I didn't really want to do too much. Oh, it's the morning. It's it was night for ages. Maybe after we met the father, that's when things kind of changed. Anthem worth exploring? No. Oh, over here. Monocular. I thought I heard a beast there for a second. Okay, notebook. Okay. You know what, I'll put that in one of my quick items real real quick. <laughs> uh, what was that? It's like you sacrifice blood in order to actually... Um, Should we be looking at Anthony in particular? No. Oh wait. Oh, I thought that was like on 
it was like electrified or something. Is that the place where we fought the cleric beast? I really don't know. Best not go down there. That's it looks like it spells disaster. Hey birdie, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Hey birdie. More pebbles. You, sir, have a very large bell or, or a chain. That's it's quite worrisome. <laughs> oh, you're one of those guys. <laughs> okay, you don't have much of a reach. I thought you'd have further than that. Oh shit. Wow. That was crazy. Pro tip, use the dodge button to try and get in close to your enemy. <laughs> I'm getting massacred here. Shit. Fuck, I'm stuck in close there. That was bad news. These are like mini bosses. Come on, son. Come on. Using way too many of these health packs. Nice. Another soul bats that does. More bloodstone shards. I don't see the use of them just right now, but if you guys can point that out to me, I'd, I'd love that. Doesn't look like there's too much special over here, just apart from these sta staircases. Can I light these? Stupid. <laughs> Email alerts. This doesn't look cool. Something's gonna pop up behind me. Closed. Well, hopefully it'll open soon. I have to remember to come back down this way. <laughs> Hope you guys are still liking the uh, Bloodborne series. If you Want to make sure to keep this up as a series, just hit that like button and I will be surely to do so. I love that fucking attack, it's amazing. Look at that, two hits, you're down son. More blood vials, good, good. It's very foggy here. I am drenched in blood. It's not a good thing. There's a few hunters here. Doesn't look the most dangerous, but it could be for us. You just down now. Oh shit. Nice two with one. There's one guy left. We can do this. <laughs> I don't know why I'm bumming myself up for like each individual counter. Or encounter. I did see with the, uh, d the developer lore uh, on lore in a minute that the devs did want us to kind of feel like we could die at any moment. So I suppose 
Is that a hunter up there? Like an actual hunter like myself? Bloody well looks like it. Oh, that's an altar. Cold blood dew. Why is my guy doing that? That was so weird. Molotov cocktail. Fucking lovely. Oh, this might be gearing us up for a fight. Uh, please no. <laughs> I've already had two boss fights pretty soon. Madman's... Fuck me. You didn't give me time to read, sir. I did not even see where he came from. I was afraid that statue was going to come to life or something. The luck of concert <laughs> concertation? Concentration on my face. I know it's quite blurry right now. It is one of those hunters, but it's not one like Father Gascione. Where'd the other dog go? There he is! Fido. They took so much damage, fuck me. Hey, buddy. Nothing else up here. Oh, okay, maybe the door. That'll lead into the cathedral. Are we gonna have a battle here? I don't know if I should really be increasing my insight too much because I don't know if it's uh, a good or a bad thing. Oh. Class. It opened up a new passageway, if you didn't see that, guys. I'll show you now in a couple of seconds. You're a beast hunter, aren't you? I knew it. That's precisely how I started out. Oh, beg pardon. You may call me Alfred. Protégé of Master Ligarius, hunter of vile bloods. So, what say you? Our prey might differ, but we are hunters, the both of us. Why not cooperate? Oh, very good. Very... Take this. Beast hunting is a sacred practice. May the good blood guide your way. Alrighty, uh, I'm not too sure what I've done. Be oodles. Go on. Just... Talk about the healing church. Talk about Bergenworth. Bergenworth is an old place of learning. And the tomb of the gods, carved out below Yarnum, should be familiar to every hunter. Well, once a group of young Bergenworth scholars discovered a holy medium deep within the tomb. This led to the founding of the Healing Church, and the establishment of blood healing. In this sense, everything sacred in Yarnum can be traced back to Bergenworth. But today, the college lies deep within a tangled wood, abandoned and decrepit. And furthermore, the Healing Church has declared Bergenworth forbidden ground. It's but only they know the password that... Okay. Farewell. It has been... At least he's on our side. I better check out what the items he gave me. Um, fire paper, coarse rubbing paper that applies fire. Awesome! <laughs> what else? He gave me prey. I don't know what that is. Oh, I think it was one of these. Yeah, it was a gesture. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I'm going to apply some of that burning paper. Because that is going to be hella of frickin' useful in a boss fight. Especially one susceptible to fire. 
Hmm. Now, where do we go? I guess we're going down here. Cool. Alrighty, so hopefully there's no boss down here. <laughs> well, I'm kind of hopeful that there is, but I'm not at the same time. I like the fire effect. Tempering blood gemstone. I thought it was a complete sheer drop there for a second. Oh shit. Oh, I thought I messed up there. I think I did, but I didn't lose any health due to the whole... Like, if you hit them within a couple of seconds, they'll actually... You'll actually get your health back. Aren't they ugly looking buggers? Yeah, the juicy back here now. Absolutely nothing. Suppose we're gonna descend the ladder. Wait a second. Ah. Oh. Don't go down there just yet. Antidote. Oh, fucking brilliant. Alright, this must be the, uh... The blood-starved... Beast. I thought there was a note there. Forgot to actually activate online. Oh shit, what's this? Any beasts around? Oh, that's pure sexy. <laughs> Let's go back to the Hunter's Dream and uh, I think I'll finish up this episode here.